Is it time to buy or sell Google stock? In this video, we're delving into Google. Our initial report was released on our website on Wednesday, 10th April 2024, and now we're providing you with a more in-depth analysis. Remember to subscribe, like, and enable notifications to stay informed about our latest analysis. Stay updated on crucial developments that could affect your investments. Improve your trading decisions with our newly launched AI stock analysis tool powered by GPT-4 at stockinvest.us. Utilize AI capabilities to receive free price predictions and comprehensive analysis for any of the 25,000 companies worldwide today. Please be aware that this video is for informational purposes only and should not be interpreted as financial advice. Since March 18, 2024, our system has identified Google as a buy candidate with a score of 1.59. Now let's analyze the stock's performance during this period. The stock has shown a gain of 5.73%. This results in an average daily return of 0.34% since being labeled as a buy candidate. The stock is currently in the upper part of a wide and weak rising trend in the short term, presenting a potential selling opportunity for short-term traders as a reaction back towards the lower part of the trend can be expected. A breakout above the top trend line at $156.70 would signal a stronger upward movement. Over the next three months, the current trend suggests a potential 3.88% change, with a return ranging between 911.5% and 4.25%. Looking ahead to the next 12 months, the trend indicates a 30.17% change, with a possible return between 12.44% and 30.68%. This projects a price range of 175.57 to 204 cents after a year. In our latest update on Google, we observed a red day on Wednesday for the tech giant. The Google stock price dropped by my.294% on Wednesday, April 10, 2024, sliding from 156.60 cents to 156 and 4 cents. Throughout the trading day, the stock fluctuated by 1.25%, ranging from a low of 154.68 to a high of 156.61. Notably, the price has seen an increase in seven out of the last 10 days and has surged by 3.63% over the past two weeks. It's worth mentioning that the decrease in trading volume on the last day aligns with the stock movement, indicating a positive trend. Specifically, trading volume dropped by minus 9 million shares, with a total of 22 million shares being exchanged for an approximate value of 3.46 billion. Looking back over the past 52 weeks, the highest stock price recorded was 158.56, while the lowest was 102.63.3. Currently, the stock is 1.53%, or 2 to its 52-week high, and 93.62%, or 2 to its 92.78, below its all-time high on June 14, 2021, when it reached 2,448.92. Analyst ratings. On Monday, April 8, 2024, Oppenheimer rated Google as outperform with a hold action. On Monday, March 25, 2024, Wedbush rated Google as outperform with a hold action. On Friday, Feb 9, 2024, Goldman Sachs rated Google as buy with a hold action. On Wednesday, Jan 31, 2024, William Blair rated Google as outperform with a hold action. On Wednesday, Jan 31, 2024, Citigroup rated Google as buy with a hold action. Analysts have given Google stock a general strong buy rating. They rate the P-E ratio as strong buy and price to book as strong buy. For return on investment, the analysts give the stock a strong buy rating. Google stock currently shows positive buy signals from both short and long-term moving averages, indicating a favorable forecast. Additionally, a buy signal is present from the relationship between the two averages, with the short term surpassing the long term. Support levels are identified at $154.30 and $144.76, with potential sell signals if these levels are breached. Despite some negative signals impacting short-term development, a recent sell signal from a pivot top suggests a macro 0.294% decrease. Another sell signal is observed from the three-month moving average convergence divergence, MACD. Notably, volume decreased in line with price, 
reducing overall risk as volume typically mirrors price movements. Here are some other signals you might find interesting. Moving average convergence divergence, sell signal, pivots, sell signal two days ago, Bollinger, buy signal 13 days ago, short-term moving average, buy signal four days ago, long-term moving average, buy signal 20 days ago. The relation between the short and the long moving averages, buy signal 17 days ago. If we look at the 12-month chart, we see short moving average, buy signal 21 days ago. The long-term moving average, buy signal 22 days ago. The relation between the short and the long moving averages, buy signal 94 days ago. Remember to go to our page at stockinvest.us if you want to find more signals. Support, Risk, and Stop Loss for Google Google's stock has key support levels at $147.68 and $142.38. If the stock breaks below $147.68, it may find further support at $142.38 and $140.10. It's important to be cautious when a stock tests a support level as a break below could lead to a decline to the next support level. With average daily movements and good trading volume, Google's stock is considered to have medium risk. On the last trading day, the stock saw $1.93 movement between its high and low, representing a 1.25% change. Over the past week, the stock has shown a daily average volatility of 2.12%. Let's start by discussing some key fundamental data before delving into potential trading levels for Google. Firstly, the price-to-earnings ratio, P-E ratio, is essential as it reflects a company's current share price in relation to its per-share earnings. A typical P-E ratio is common in businesses with established histories or stable revenue streams. Moving on, the upcoming earnings report for Q1 2024 is slated for April 23, 2024. Analysts, consensus estimates stand at $1.49. Monitoring these figures is crucial as they hold the potential to significantly impact stock prices. Now let's delve into potential day trading levels for Google. In an upward trend, the initial resistance level for Google stands at $156.60. If you're not holding any shares, consider waiting for this level to be surpassed before making a move. For current stockholders, this could be a viable level for swing trading. Conversely, Google faces its first support level at $147.60 on the downside. Should this support hold firm, it might present an opportune entry point, anticipating a bounce back. The combined average rating for Google from multiple analyst sources is a strong buy. Now, let's delve into some recent insider trades. On the 2024 0117, Pichai Sundar conducted an insider sell of 3,488 shares of Class C capital stock. On the same day, Pichai Sundar also sold 15,323 shares of Class C capital stock. Additionally, on 2024-117, Pichai Sundar sold 3,689 shares of Class C capital stock. Looking back to 2023-314, Hennessy John L. made an insider buy of 3,580 shares of Class C capital stock. However, on 2024-01-11, Hennessy John L. sold 2,400 shares of Class C capital stock. After analyzing the 100 most recent insider trades, we've determined the insider power to be negative with a ratio of minus 10.384. Overall, insiders purchased 1,458,265 1 shares and sold 820,044 shares in the last 100 trades. Our recommended stop loss is set at $150.22, representing a decrease of 3.79%. This stock exhibits moderate daily movements, indicating a medium level of risk. A sell signal was identified from a pivot top observed one day ago. Is Google stock a good buy? Considering various short-term signals and a positive trend, it appears that there may be a buying opportunity for Google stock in the short term. However, our analysis indicates that the current price of Google stock is overvalued based on its recent volatility and movements. Looking ahead to trading on Thursday, April 11th, we anticipate Google to open down by Nija 33 cents, starting at 155.81 cents. 
It is important to remember that trading carries a high risk of financial loss. Before making any investment decisions, it is advisable to consult with a financial advisor. Stockinvest.us should not be the sole basis for your investment choices. By utilizing this information, you are responsible for your own investment outcomes. Presenting our current view of the stock. Share your thoughts. Do you agree or disagree? Drop a comment below and let us know your target for this stock. Don't forget to like and subscribe for more updates. Wishing you successful trading and a wonderful day from all of us here at Stock Invest.